Hey, so I've got this hefty fab skid plate. Uh, it's real nice. Um, so just real quick, um, I have a, I have a Mojave, so there's gonna be some hardware that goes here. It's a bolt, two washers, and a nut. On the side here, bolt, two washers, and nut. And we have the bag of hardware right here. So here's everything you need. So there's about this is where the front will end up. This hex hole here, and then the side. This hex hole here. And what I've done is I've taken off these reservoir uh, brackets that hold the existing uh, skid plate. And I've trimmed them down. Um, I'm going to reuse those. So that should still sit there. And the same thing on this side too. So I'll show you what I've done for the brackets here. So cut these brackets uh, on this angle. So it was like trimmed off a piece here, here, and here. So I just took the Dremel and just went jut, jut, jut. This one came out a little, a little funky. This one came out real nice. Painted it. It's drying right now. But here's the excess of it. And you can kind of see, see how that comes out there. This one here. How that comes off. So that one piece and it comes off and this bottom bolt here this this is what holds on to this to skid plate so anyways all right so here's the chopped bracket you can see I made a cut here here and also here below and then you just reattach the reservoir once you put this back on with the existing uh, stock bolts you can reattach the reservoir here and here and it clears out of the way for uh, the skid plate these are kind of in the way but I can make do with those because that's both gonna attach here and here and look at it over here it's really easy to fit in there all right so we got the driver's size done looks really nice again cleaned it up here here and here so you've got a little lip here uh, before a little step here I kind of left the back hanging a little bit just in case something does want to come up and bang it I've got a little bit of protection not a lot but you know at least it's got something there to kind of slide off of anything uh, just reinstall the hasting bolts and then Put your reservoir back on. That looks pretty good, huh? All right, there it is. Button that up pretty good. So when you put this in initially, I actually had this flat against the uh, horn here, and actually it tilts a little bit, so you can get that bolt in there. So that's pretty good. Uh, it was a little hard just to get the inside washer in the top, but not not too bad. It was actually really really easy. So. There it is, and let's go back here. Yeah, I can see it. Hefty Fab, go check them out, man. Not sponsored or anything, but they make some really good products, especially for the Jeep and other off road vehicles as well. So, shout out to them. They did a great job. Um, so, this is the skid plate. We're going to go ahead and remove the bumper in a later video, and we'll get to show you that. Um, on the upcoming video uh, plus we're gonna add a winch and some new fog lights and, and uh, also their tall hoop so again it'll be another hefty fab product I'll I'll probably do a review on the install this one was pretty good this is pretty easy um, for the Mojave again I just trimmed those brackets real nice and actually let's go we can actually look here real quick how much it clears so you can see it's clear there's really no nothing in there so really nice sorry about the camera angle here uh, but you can see here it's really clear here nice skid here kids playing in the sprinkler anyways like comment subscribe it's a great little product man awesome